Hello guys and welcome to the channel. On today's video is a review about P42 Climax. The guys at Pulse and Modular emailed me to do a review about their plugin. So this is it guys. The first thing I'll do is go through the user interface and then I'll obviously play audio through it so you guys can hear the quality of it. Then we will jump into conclusion what we make of it. So the first thing is you've got a high pass and low pass filter which you can turn on and off by clicking on the light button. This X2 is for oversampling and it's give you two options here. One says Intel, the other one says Vint, which I believe this is vintage. I may be wrong. So the guys will obviously correct me if I'm wrong. So the other thing is here, you've got Rev A and Rev B, which you can change whichever one you want. This is direct. You can also do mid side by sliding this and it tells you which one you are at. So you've got wet and dry knob here. You've also got drive, which says you drive input signal into the transformer. And then you've got output to back it down. It's also give you an EQ here, which is low shelf and high shelf. So this is air, which is more of a, from 5K to 12K. So you can boost it by up to 10 dB. So let's bring it back to where it was. So this is pretty much the quick overview of it. You've also got your saturation slider here and you can choose to be at output or at input by clicking on the button there. And uh, first thing actually seen on this plugin is it sounds good, but this reminded me of some UAD plugins whereby they've actually added some boost so that immediately you throw it on, you will feel like, wow, this is doing a lot. So if you notice here, there's actually 0.55 boost already on the low end and here as well on the high end, 0.55 boost at 750. So obviously you throwing this on straight away with that boost will give you a bit of edge, which can be a bit misleading, but we will obviously get into that later on when I slide it down. On this saturation bit, you've also got 0.9% from onset. So bear that in mind. So apart from that, let's have a listen to it and then back everything off and then we will decide what you guys think. So there you go guys, the plugin is good as you can hear, it does add something very nice to the audio in general, it's very musical. The concept is good but one thing I didn't quite like about the plugin is the download. Because for me to actually download this plugin I had to go to the website and put all details including country, email address and creating an account whereby ask even phone number and everything. Which for me I feel like it's not good for someone trying to demo a plugin that can actually put the person off but apart from that every other thing is awesome i enjoyed this plugin so let me know what you think on the comment section if you feel like the plugin is worth it thanks guys don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and also head to my community tab where i've posted what video would you like to see next what tutorial video so the vote is still ongoing and i'll be wrapping that up by next week